when you play an introduction, you are establishing uh, the harmonic context of the song and the rhythmic uh, sense of the song. What would be the tempo of the song and what would be the tonality of the song and then uh, the vibe of the song. If you're going to do something twice or if you're going to repeat something, and what am I repeating? I'm repeating a 1625. You want to have a difference between the first time and the second time. So the first time was what? Now, if you're still using a simple introduction like that, sometimes you can in insert some uh, uh, kind of like a solo line on it, over that, like you're soloing over your introduction. So, for example, one, two, three, four. Something that is common you start on the flat at five, on the B. So you have B. This time we start on the four. So let's say we are in B flat again. So your intro can start on E flat major. You can take risks in music, it's important to take risks and all that, but when you're establishing the introduction, it's very good for you to be clear, because everybody is counting on you to set it up.